Hi guys, just wanted to do an XRP video. Uh, I know that XRP is a hot topic usually. Um, I do have some XRP, uh, a fairly large bag of this, but um, we can see that today it's pumping. Now, I haven't heard of any fundamental news uh, today, uh, you know, that it should be pumping for any reason. So, um, Anyways, we can see in the summer the pump from uh, well about 46 cents on up to almost a dollar that day. Um, but since then, it's just been kind of struggling with this you know lowest level of Fibonacci here. <clears throat> now we did get above this briefly, very briefly um, in November. And uh, since then we've basically, trended down until February, uh, but now we're starting to see a little bit of a trend upwards. Um, is XRP out of the woods? Definitely not. Um, it needs to definitely close the daily candle uh, above the line uh, here at about 68 cents. We're quite above that right now, but that's not a guarantee. XRP can come down fast if, if bitcoin goes down fast xrp and everything goes down fast you know or if bitcoin's going up really quickly lately we've seen a lot of liquidity get sucked out um <clears throat> i don't know if this is people taking bitcoin profits and rotating it into xrp because maybe they expect um the lawsuit you know to be finished soon or something you know similar to this um, that could be maybe people just, you know, have a little extra money at the moment while Bitcoin is pumping. Um, now, if we take a look at the longer history of this, you know, we can see we have basically been down this red zone since April of 2022, you know, with exception of brief stints, you know, above this red line. Um, <clears throat> The last bull run, uh, we did see XRP go to around $2. Um, now, I remember this time I did have some XRP. I should have taken profits, but, you know, I didn't. And a lot of people thought, well, you know, XRP will pump higher. And people were thinking maybe $3 or so. Now, XRP can and will pump. Um, it just, everything really depends on this lawsuit. We have to finish this lawsuit, uh, completely. Now in the summer, they did get a big win. That was great, but it's not completely finished. That's the thing. Don't, you know, put all your bags in this basket. <clears throat> I do, like I said, have, I, I have XRP and, you know, it's a, it's a sizable amount, but if, you know, if XRP were to lose, then yeah, it will probably all come crashing down and, um, you know, so be it. But it's not something that I'm putting all my eggs in one basket. Now, where do I think XRP is going this cycle? Well, everything depends on the lawsuit. But I think, you know, at a, a minimum, probably we're going to see two dollars but I believe we can make it to three and if the lawsuit is finished let's see the top here on this Fibonacci is about seven dollars forty cents <clears throat> now if we uh, finish the lawsuit I do believe seven dollars and forty cents is a bit low honestly I think XRP can be a $15 to $25 coin if the lawsuit is finished. So um, this bull run, I do expect to break, you know, the last bull run's highs, but don't expect anything magical until this lawsuit finishes. And I'm not sure if there's any time frame for this um but yeah you just have to keep 
our eyes open, I guess, if you're an XRP fan, and uh, hope and pray. But XRP, <clears throat> at the moment, it is starting to look a little bit better, but it's not, you know, in the best, you know, of, of you know, <laughs> the best form, we can say. Um, I would ideally like to see this break above maybe this line here, about 94 cents. Um, if we can break above this, most of the volume is going to be below us. Yeah, okay, there is some volume here, a little bit up here, but we get above 94 cents, just say a dollar, then probably we can move a bit quicker, you know, upwards. Um, so take this information as you will. This is not financial advice. Um, you know, I, I don't know yet where I, I'm planning to take, you know, profits on this coin. Um, but like I said, lawsuit finished, you're probably looking at least about $15 for this coin because this coin has been so suppressed. And, uh, you know, I just believe it's going to be eaten up, you know, by many, many, many retail uh, and possibly we will see companies, you know, start to have a, a craving for this coin. You know, we might see an ETF in the future with this coin as long as it, su it succeeds in court. So now I don't think that's going to be next year, maybe, you know, three, four years. It could be. But take this as you will. Um, this is just not financial advice. Um, this is just my thoughts on this coin. Like I said, I do hold it. So I wish it the best and I wish everybody the best in this coin. Um, so if you like this, you know, like and subscribe and uh, thank you.